Good morning. Team Ford is here. M80. There's a trooper. Morning. It's a little chilly. There's a willow. Alrighty. So this is our uh, third day in Acala National Forest. Just want to shoot a little video in here. It's been a really, really beautiful little trail. <clears throat> Last night we stayed at a little campsite by a place called Hidden Pond. Which is really nice. We got in early. Got the miles done quick. <clears throat> and uh, Oh geez, I guess we were about four o'clock, weren't we, huh? Yeah, a little before. And uh, this is left 20 miles today to get into the 88 store, which we have a, a resupply box there. So we just enjoyed it. And there was a whole big group of Boy Scouts there. That was interesting. Uh, but we got out today just a little bit after six. Got to do a little, a little walking in the dark. It was a cold morning. I don't. I don't know if I was ever this cold on the Appalachian Trail. Ooh, you? No, it has been. These have been the last. These last two nights have been so cold. I mean, I know the. I know temperatures were colder, but for whatever reason, Ooh. just my body, just the feeling of it has been colder on this trail. Uh, but Ocala National Forest is just. I mean, it is really cool. We're really liking it. It's been pretty super. Willow's doing, Willow's doing great. Haven't seen any bear yet. Seen, there's a blaze. Seen uh, a lot of bear sign, but not any bears. And we hung last night. Uh, that'll make some people happy. <laughs> some people probably laugh, but. All the Boy Scouts were there and they were hanging, so we thought it was only polite to polite to hang. And of course, we used the PCT method. They used the rope over branch method, <laughs> or whatever else they could do. But it is the it is the park regulations. You you either have a bear canister or you hang in here. So we did hang. Beautiful campsite. Little hidden pond, just crystal clear water. You could wade out in there, fill your water bottles up. It was nice. So, like I said earlier, today we're hiking about 20 miles to a place called Store 88. We've already called ahead. The guy said we can tent there. And we got resupply box coming there. Hopefully, it should be there today. Anything you want to say, huh? We well, want to say how happy we were to have uh, Trooper Cobra come hike with us yesterday and the day before. Oh, yeah, that was awesome. We had a friend from the Appalachian Trail, Trooper Cobra, and he came and hiked uh, about a day and a half with us. We uh, a really cool campsite with a. Uh, oh, that's right, yeah, our first night. Our first night camping with him. We pushed it pretty late, we, where we initially thought we were going to camp, didn't turn out to be so good. So we hiked on, and there was this place where you could do group camping, and there was a fraternity out there. I mean, a big fraternity. And they put, were partying hard, weren't they, hon? Yeah, they were. They were <laughs> so nice, though. So we get there, and we're like, you know, there's a water pump there, so we asked them, they would mind if we got some water there to pump them. They were like, nah, dude, whatever you want. And then, so we got water, and we asked, hey, you guys mind if we find a little tent site somewhere off in the woods there? Ah, oh, dude, no, no problem. <laughs> Go for it. We'll keep, we might keep you awake, though, because they were loud. I mean, until three, four in the morning, partying hard. They had those little octopus things hanging from the tree where you, I guess you guzzle down beer and stuff. I guess that's what it's for. I'm a little bit, that's past my age. Uh, and then, so we're sitting there and a couple of them were talking to us about hiking and I couldn't help myself. I, I said, hey, 
you got a six pack you want to sell? <laughs> so I don't know if that counts as yogiing or not, but I think it does. But they did, they brought us like three different kinds of beer and they wouldn't take our money. They were just super nice folks, but boy were they having a party. Uh, so that was neat. So we got beer our first night in the Cala National Forest. Come out and hike with us now, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Where's our friends that said they were gonna hike with us? Yeah. Daddy Long Legs. Hello. Oreo, Quahog Well. Oreo hurt her knee, darn it. Zag. Oreo oh. hurt her knee gets better, girl. Yeah. Zag. Ow. I haven't, I haven't contacted Wade yet. I have to let him know. He can come hike with us sometime in here. And then uh uh, Cash. Yeah. Have to, I'm going to shoot him a text. He had mentioned he might want to come hike. Anybody's welcome. Oh, we, anybody. We'd love the company. Yeah, let me turn this off here. Huh? So, anything you just want to say? Ooh, I'm chilly. It is. Hey. Yeah, it's been a cold morning. It's beautiful. It's going to be hot, so that's why we wanted to get started early, though. So. Oh, yeah. You, so, yeah. here It's like a desert in here. In parts. It's just like a like the Florida desert. So you go through these areas where you have no cover. Isn't that gorgeous though? I hope y'all can, I don't know how good these videos show it, but. I have sand in my shoes. It's really pretty. I think for the first time in a long time, Patty has, Trooper has no blisters. Do you? No, no tape on the feet. Nor do I. The first time in the whole trail, the whole, even from the Keys. Yeah, yeah. My feet have finally gotten better. You think, Willow? Although my shin splints hang. Hey. Comes and goes. No, there's no blueberries. But Willow's doing great. She hadn't had any, she's loving this part. This is great. Okay, well, we'll try to take a little bit later on. Everybody have a great day. Have a good one.